I think. Oh, no, 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 no. Woohoo! Roman coin. Lovers, oh, I'm back out on a lovely day. Mm. And it's extra specially nice today because I did a little experiment on YouTube. I put up a page that had the sub counts of four metal detectorists, right? And that as an experiment, I put it up on on a live stream. So all you could see was who was going to prevail, and then these four metal detectorists and then a link in the description to each of their pages. And it's a live stream continuously going during the, during the nighttime hours when I was asleep. And I did that and I woke up the next morning and YouTube had given me a strike and taken down the uh, video. <gasps> oh, yes, a strike. Mm. So I peeled and I've won and they've rein reinstated the video. So all I've got to do now is I'm thinking that possibly I will put up a page of 50 uh, YouTubers, metal detecting YouTubers, and have that going during the hours of uh, night time when I'm asleep. I can set it going, wake up in the morning and uh, it will list all the top YouTubers with the person at the top say, I'm guessing I Detect Harry's probably got the most uh, uh, subscribers with like, near on 30,000. And then uh, listing below each person going down the order to the bottom one. And I'm thinking about 50, not sure. And um, so if you'd like to contact me in the description below, give me your uh, details or just, just your YouTube channel and uh, I'll add it to this page which I'm going to put up. And uh, it will just show all the top YouTubers, metal detecting YouTubers in the UK. Um, I'm thinking that you've got to have um, possibly um, at least 500 subscribers. All right, my lovers? Right, that's enough waffling. I got signal down here. What do you reckon? 10p? like a coin. Nope. 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 Oh, it's fallen out. Right, it's down here somewhere. What's that there? Ah! 20p! Woohoo! Right, my lovers, someone asked me the other day what are my settings. Right, so let's have a look here. One, I got this fully open, so there's the ear order metal as well. Right, so tone ID profile is. Uh, hold on, let's have. Yeah, that one. Uh, it's on combined, right? Right, so go back. 
uh, response is pitch hold. It's like um, it's a it's good for finding deep object objects. Pitch hold. Recovery deep. Uh, target separation high trash. But sometimes I change it to ground coin. Pinpoint normal. I don't like that sizing. And that's my uh, settings. Right, I got a target just here. It looks like a good one. Ah, it is just a little tiny washer. Let's give me a good signal. Pesky thing. Right, on to the next. Go look at this signal just here. Oh, how about a nice hammered coin? I haven't had one of those for over a week. lower not such a good signal now Add it. I think I got it. Oh, nope, it's not a hammered coin. It is. Oh, I think it's a scabbard point. Yep, yeah, I think it is. It's a nice scabbard point. There would have been leather coming out here and the blade would have gone in and this would have just protected the point of the, uh, you know, so you didn't stab yourself. You can tell by that little join there, look. If it was a bit of copper pipe, it wouldn't have a join. And you can also, there's also that little bit there where something might have fitted over it. And that's what it is. Proper artifact. I knew it sounded good. On to the next. Go cool, look at this. I got here, my lovers. Oh, it's huge. Now, what is it? Is it iron? Do you think that's iron? Well, I'm not sure because nothing's showing up down here. But there's a big blob there. Could be iron. Nope, it's not iron. It's a funny place for it though. Well, it's a funny thing for being in the middle of a field. That says three eighths, and it looks like Les 300. Maybe. And on this side, it's got a funny looking 
crossed zeros, a bit like the uh, Olympic flag. I think it must be off a tractor. Still, nice bit of scrap. On to the next. Oh, look at this signal I got here. Nothing on the screen, could be a bit of lead. Whoa, 12.22. 12.22, that's a uh, hammered cake. Hammered coin range. <laughs> oh. Four oiler button. Just as Paul would say. Go cool, look at this signal I got down in here somewhere. looking signal. Cross your fingers. <gasps> uh oh. Looks like gold. Uh oh. Ah, oh, it's a pesky button. But a gold one. Oh, it's got a nice design on it. Oh, I thought it had a bit of gold then, my levers. But no, it's a gilt button. Right, I'm going to get this cleaned up and I'll get back to you. Oh, there it is, my levers. Yeah, it is a gold gilted button. It's got some sort of, I don't know if that's antlers or what. That's an antler. Or is it just flowers or something? Still quite a nice button. Nothing on the back that I can see. Yeah, I don't know if that's antlers or... I think there's a flower just to there, just to, to the sort of left. Like a bit of a flowery design. Right, on to the next. Cool, look at this signal I got here. How about a nice silver sixpence? Oh, looks really nice.
Explore. Oh, what was that? Ooh, what is that? Oh, it's gone a bit gungy. Oh, I can see the date on the bottom really clearly. Oh. Yeah, look, there's the date. 1807. So it must be a George the Third. But you don't usually come out this with the, um, you know, the plating that they have used to have, have them plated, didn't they? You know, it says George there. Strange. This side's a bit worse. So it's a George the Third. Yeah, but the original got the original um, clad covering because they're plated, aren't they? Yeah. Right. Bizarre. On to the next. Here, you are my lovers. The reason I've got it here on uh, combined tones is because um, you can clearly hear the good signal next to the crappy one. <laughs> I was hitting grunting first and then good tone and then the opposite way uh, good tone and then grumpy So there's the good tone. And there she blows. And it is I think, oh, no, 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 woohoo, Roman coin. Oh, it's a little Roman, right, gloves off. Oh, oh yes, 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 yes. Want focus? Ah, here we go. Oh, we've got a little head on there. Right, this one looks a bit manky. I think it's crumbling around the edge as we speak. Right, I'm going to have to get this in the bag of water, I think. But yes. A little Roman coin. Lovely jubbly. Right. Right, there it is my lovers all cleaned up. Well, about as much as I can do in the middle of a field. So, I don't know, it looks a bit odd scene. It's like two people standing next to each other with some sort of spears. I suppose it is spears. And on the other side, the detail is, it's a pity it's crumbling, but the detail is absolutely fantastic.
I'll have to get that in some water and then some uh, get some of that um, waxy stuff on there because it is the edges are crumbling. Right, so uh, no doubt someone will tell me who who this chap is, and uh, let's see if I can find some more. Oh, look at this signal I got here. Looks like a nice moo tube. Saying that, there's nothing on the screen, so it might not be. It might be a good big hammered coin. Where is it to? Oh, what's that? Oh. It's a pesky button. Anything on this pesky button? No. Oh. I was going to say that was a loud signal. I couldn't find it. Um, nothing on the pesky button that I can see. What about the... Ooh, I've got some more gold. Oh, right. It says London on there on the bottom. It says London. I don't think it says Londinium, which is uh, Roman for London. And then it says, what does it say? Looks like Gen Gen Gen. Double N E N. Oh, can't quite read the rest of it. Can you see it there, my lovers? Right, on to the next. Oh, so that's it, me lovers. Oh, <laughs> too many holes. Right, I'm gonna pack up now, head off home, and have some jars of ale a bit later. So, yeah, if you want to. Uh, I put in the description below if you want to um, have your uh, metal detecting channel um, on my um, new. I've got. A, I've made a new um, channel, so I've got a brand new channel called the Metal Detectorists, right? So uh, what I'll do is I'll be doing these live streams with all of the uh, metal detectorists who want to be on there, um, and the live stream it will just be going constantly. And what people do is they can see, they can go straight to that page instead of doing that thing on YouTube that is absolutely rubbish, isn't it? Down the side, it, it doesn't really do much, does it? <laughs> it's, it's a hell of a game trying to find someone that you want to, um, you know, it doesn't, you know, what it needs to do is it needs to have an, an order where the, the people that have posted recently are at the top of the list. And it's all higgledy-piggledy and it's, it doesn't work very well. So I'm hoping that I'll be able to do this page and then you'll be able to see who is doing better than the other people purely by their, um, their subscribers, the amount of subscribers that they've got. So it's sort of like 1 to 50. 
me, me hopes, me thinks. Cheers. True love and gently drops the rain.